Hello, Zero Hero. Welcome back to the Vampire Survivors. So we unlock Mortesio. Whatever, however you pronounce that name. Uh... I want to actually want to try it out in the eight lab in late library. Oh, it just throws a boat. That trick is says on the enemies. That's a strange ability. Wait, there should be a level up gem here. Let's go fireball. So yeah, the boat is a new one. That probably unlocks the moment you play this character to a certain point. Like with uh, a lot of the other abilities. For the special characters. have enough projectiles to keep up with all of these. Don't really want these. Well, let's actually get them set more coins. Yeah, I got trapped. Dealing with all of these. Nice, nice, longer base area. On. Let's see how that works. Pretty sure it needs something like an AOD to actually deal with this. Game's just not giving me the option. That's the big boss. Also, the boat is not that effective. You just hit one enemy, then bounces back. I think it needs piercing or something. Or some kind of uh, enemy detection. So at the moment, it's kind of useless. Another level of stone mass. Can it give me something else? This is kind of useless on the upgrades. And the bone only does like one damage on the boss. Oh, 
that's stopwatch. That's it, that. Please, everyone. Yeah, the bone is not that great. Unless you can actually hit it between enemies. It is kind of useless. Unless the upgrade is really bit better. Oh, level. Could be something useful. Oh, level 4 fire ones. Still not great. Because this boss has, uh, is having a kind of a will of its own and firing. Oh, I tried to get to uh, another level. Hopefully get something I can use. Get like a pacing attack. Well actually the prison will be great for this. But it might not even give me the option. I'm not getting the pentagram. Well, that is literally delete everything. Also all your experience. But that's kind of a hard lock. Unlike progression. Oh, that's cool, these uh, mid-bosses. Get all experience. Well, that's duplicated. Eh? Oh, we're slowly getting somewhere. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my fireball is doing most of the work. Seven minutes in, only level nine. Yeah, that that works. All more of those, and I'm dead. I'm literally lacking the crowd control ability. I say crowd control, any control ability. Really? It's just. Well, I'm dead. Almost dead. Just fight into the bookcase. Completely negating that attack. I'm pretty sure I'm not getting through this. Unless I get a massive upgrade. Which I doubt I will get. Especially when the my abilities are just firing against uh, items I can't do anything with. Uh, yeah, I'm not getting those two anytime soon. Like that will be a lifesaver, but uh, I can't even pick up experience. That's just way too many of these.
yeah, that's uh, not a problem. Adam. Let's try that again and hopefully get something useful. That was like 10 minutes. I have 400 something coins. Let's see, is there anything I can buy for that? Probably not. Nope. Yeah, I don't know if I like the uh, this character. I could try Antonio. He starts with the yeah increases damage. Let's try Antonio on the library. That is the Laurel. It prevents damage. Well, let's get the garlic early on. That's, that's like my main uh, damage dealer. Like the moment you get this early on, you just run through these. Let's start getting the whip. a lot of the uh, basic weapons. Let's see what crazy in this uh, can happen. Let's just get garlic. So upgraded range. Yeah, this is already getting way better than the uh, other one. It's just like day and night. Let's get whip leveled up. Not that I really need it at this point. And garlic on these weak enemies is like 100% worth it. Even just level 1. I can just run through these. So, movement speed or the track board. Let's actually try movement speed. I don't know if it's an achievement for uh, getting high level movement speeds. Even at the two minute mark, and we're already uh, pretty high level. Call it up. Yeah, I'm already at level 8 on like the two minute mark. Yeah, this is crazy. Oh, look, it's more of the weak enemies. There we go. King Bibble. A lot of the naming in this game is like a joke, so... Might as well call it King Bibble. Ebony Wings bombard in a circling zone. Oh, that's the new one. Let's try that one. Wait, can you have two of these? That was counterclockwise. The other is, uh, I think, clockwise. Yeah, if I can get the other one, that would be great. Let's see, there's the room trace there. I don't want it at the moment. Let's get the stone mask, because that's a utility item. It decreases uh, the amount of money you get. We get the uh, passive upgrades after a run.
So there's Pitchon and Ebony Wings that you can get. Uh, I'm getting damaged. And I'm full health again. Yeah, so let's get... Wait. Just upgrade all the weapons before getting a new one. Yeah, the whip is doing really good damage. I'm pretty sure the whip is really useful on this level because it's uh, horizontal. the axe. Well, that's not that great. Let's upgrade the mask. Let's get the chest. We get the level King Bibble. So level 3. Base speed up and area increased. Yeah, the massive amount of experience on this. I think I like this zone better than the uh, first zone. But mostly because of uh, a lot of stuff is close to each other. So it's way easier to get more uh, levels. Yeah, let's get a bit leveled up. I don't want to see what happens if you get the max level on that one. Yeah, it's doing close to like 30 damage per hit. Oh, I forgot I can just kill those immediately. So I basically want to run into the uh, flying hordes. That's something I want to spell the cross. That's one of the most superior weapons. Now the only thing I want is the uh, uh, pigeon. So I can have both of them, both the flyers. No, I don't want these. Actually, projectile speed might be useful. I didn't know the rege uh, think regeneration would work because of my low health. Like, if I had way more health, then yeah. I don't want to pick that up yet. I want to gain one level first. Me. 
Level 7. Base them up at 5. Oh, that's useful. Yeah, they're doing close to 40 damage. Here comes experience. So, stone mask. Oh, the big ones I can insta kill. They have way more health. Doesn't need to at least hit twice. That's the ghosts. There we go. Yeah, let's level up garlic. Actually, let's get lucky. Here. That should help. At least I hope so. I wonder if that helps with criticals. Possess get 10 percent luckier. But might. Oh, that's a mid boss. There's the mummies. Stupid amount of ghosts. There's so many. Just kind of lap a second heal. Yeah, that literally pushing me down. Just the sheer amount of enemies. Oh, don't throw the benches at me. Try to get all the experience. At least level up once. There we go. Duplicated. That's the pigeon. And that's the freeze to every enemy.
and let's see what we get. Also, Bibble. Level 4. Less longer. Oh, fire one more projectile. Yeah, let's get more duplicators. Oh, we have triple hits on uh, the whip. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is actually really good. Especially with the duplicator. So everything should have one more projectile. I mean, basically, can have double pitches. So we have one more utility slot. <coughs> Just giving me money. That, that it is. Garlic. Almost level. Ah, it's single. Speed. I think it's always a movement speed on this. Yeah, movement speed increased by 10%. Yeah, so Actually, weapon cooldown reduction. That thing they will way more active. Yeah, 8% cooldown reduction is pretty big amount. Especially with all the abilities I have, all the weapons. Oh yeah, uh, let's see... Yeah, try to level up the cross burner. Oh, that was that does the better it is. The old base speed up. Yeah, that's the problem. That's a problem, especially with the uh, mid boss trying to uh, get really close. Let's see, base speed up, base area up. Oh yeah. Hello. What's the lag? The game's just slowing down. Well, not that surprising, but the amount of enemies that are uh, on the field and the amount of bullets I'm firing. I don't even have the most crazy weapons yet.
Let's get the lock off. Yeah, so basically it have a through. Level up. Another clover. Another clover. Level 5 clover. Yeah, I do really wonder if the uh, crit chance goes up if you have a lot of luck. You know that this is a basically a disaster. Level up again. Please everything clover. Kill the boss. If I can. Because this should drop me a chest. But I did get the clover. Yep, that is. Just can't get to it. Oh, didn't get it. And there's no more wings. So, movement speed up. That's not that great. Well, it does help with fading a bunch of these. That's a way too big. Yeah. Seriously, the bombs are really what's mostly killing me. Oh well. That's it for this episode. So thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next.